Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Excel Bytes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today we're going to take a look at how to format multiple worksheets in a workbook to match one that you like and have set up properly using the fill across worksheets option in Excel. So let's see how we can do that in Excel. So here's our scenario. I have four worksheets and on the first one I have data for Detroit and it's formatted just the way I like it with the black background and white text here in a 14 size font. Uh, the January through December is bold in a white text with a blue background centered. These are all in bold, the products and the values are all done with uh, the number format with no decimal places and there's borders everywhere. So I set this up just like I want it and you can see in sheet 2, sheet 3, and sheet 4 it's just basic blank no formatting done at all and I want to format the other three worksheets like I've set up on sheet 1. So what we would do, the first thing we would do is we would group the worksheets. Now the easiest way to do that is select the first one you want, hold down your shift key, select the last one, and it will group all the worksheets. And you can see up in the top bar, it says that the worksheets are grouped. Next, highlight the range that you want to match the format of in other worksheets. So I've highlighted A1 to M16. Then I go to the Home tab, and in the editing group, you see the fill option here. And I select the drop down, and there's an option for across worksheets. I'll select that, and my options are to fill the contents, the format, or both. In this case, I'm just going to choose format, and I'll say OK. Now, when I ungroup them just by clicking on a different worksheet, you'll see that sheet 2 is formatted, sheet 3 is formatted, and sheet 4 are all formatted just like I had sheet 1. So that's an easy way to format other worksheets like you want and you've set up on your first worksheet. Now again, as you saw with fill across worksheets, you can fill across not only the format but also the contents. So just for ex an example of that, you can see the values in each one of these are slightly different. But if I selected sheet one, highlighted the contents here, grouped the worksheets together, and selected fill across worksheets and selected contents and said OK, You'll see on sheet one I have 9,900 in the first one and 9,100 in the very last cell. Sheet two, 99 to 91. Sheet three, the same, and sheet four. So I've actually used the fill across worksheets to fill the contents instead of the format. I could have done both at the same time if I would have selected all. So that's how you can use this option in Excel. So thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so at my website, excel-bice.com, or at any of the social networks noted below. Thanks a lot, have a great day, and happy excelling.